nicely and into the last turn. Nice and tidy back on the power as fast as possible. He does bring that time down by almost three tenths of a second. A 131.5 from the Red Bull. As these cars are all revving up, a strong start for the Red Bull squad as AJ is now going to be able to get Pile of Garbage. And Pile of Garbage is out immediately at that. It's hurtful as Jet just won this championship already. And it's not even turn one. Unbelievable. The, the man that was in P2 is in P2 in the er, in the driver's championship. Apologies. Spins out, hits the wall, DNS off the grid. That, oh, that has to hurt. As I do oh. see it, Marco and Body fight it out for that P10 position, but also in front of him. I believe that was what? That's freeway crash. five dropping all the way down to ninth position. Body. I think that was Body is doing that from the session. Is this going to bring out a full safety car? We already have two DNS on the opening lap here at a wet coat of circuit. Constructors uh, title, if they keep going like this, it's a really nice one too they're having. If they, even if they get uh, the fastest lap, it could look really, really good for them. But... Into turn one. Oh, is he's going down the inside. As the, Mer as the McLaren, apologies, ran wide there in turn one. He's he winning the Constructors Championship unless, unless there's a really big mistake by either one or both of the drivers, but it's looking really good for Alpine right now. They have to just hold those positions and they'll be champions. And a Red Once Bull again, just... I do want to go and look at Mr. Dangwu, who he is all over the rear end of Calculus, trying to take different lines, and I think he just got by Calculus. He did. And into turn two, Dangwu taking that P11 position. That Alpine team. Ooh, the thumbs come wide. Oh, there is a yellow flag in Sector 3. Is it... I think it is Thumbs as he has lost a massive amount of time between Jet, AJ, and Mr. Thumbs DK. Axel and accounting for losses. I switched off of them. are going side by side around the trio of turns. And this is some great racing between the Aston Martin and the Mercedes in front of them. As the Aston Martin is able to take the lead. Obviously Jet is leading this race. That's also beeping Cantor. So good on Leakey, but he's got to bring it to Kimi Harkinen. Yeah, this is the battle that we're going to keep an eye on because Axel Heineken going down to the inside, down the straight, trying to break the toe. As we'll see that Williams car is going to be able to keep the position. And once again, he is five to ten minutes. As Deng Wu picking up the first three-second time penalty of the day. As he is now leading the DHL time penalty award awarded by uh, Biggles at the end of the sorry. race. My friends have Rolex time penalty award right now. Rolex. I'll take a cheap one. It doesn't matter. That's what we're trying okay. for, my friend. That's what the new puns are out there. Rolex will listen. We're bringing it. And I'll tell you what, these gladiators for Division 2 are bringing it only in the motorsports, aren't they? Yeah. Thumbs Eight DK. seconds up the road from Thumbs DK. But further back, yes, the battle is still in the middle of the field and still definitely heating up the track temperature, per se, as the rain is going to go a little lighter as Axel goes a little twirly coming out of the corner. Yeah, we're going to go. Know how to crunch these numbers. Well, that kind of took away from the battle for P9 as Klinsman now holding up Dengu. We're going to go look at those two fighting it out coming through P5. Seconds. It is has now turned into four cars, two of them being an Aston Martin, a Williams and an Alpine all fighting for that P5 position as we'll see if Axel is going to be able to get in front of any of these cars. See the drivers that are improving, that are getting better. And it's been great watching that as the season has unfolded and i'm sure biggles could second that so, any day of the week it's a lot about feel and a lot about you know should i should i do it this lap or next and uh yeah it's a gamble so the p6 all on track he's done a phenomenal job in that aston martin he has caught up to his teammate who is putting the pressure on thumbs dk as Kamel snuck his way in there in the p3 oh so we do yet. have a yellow flag Ooh, in sector two Kimi Heineken going around. There is, he just lost a lot of time to Victor Diaz, the man that he was fighting. Divisions here at LA Motorsports as we get ready oh. for the Christmas break. But look at that, Axel on thumbs decay. Wow. He can't I'm get an overtake, can you? Yeah, Axel I'm not. going down the inside into the hairpin, just not able to get it done on thumbs DK. Yes, let's go ahead and take that away. <laughs> there is our Alliant Motorsports Champions division on the Saturdays. Isn't, I do isn't it? It's, it's like the best of the best. That's coming down your chimney for Christmas if you get that one in the bag. Yeah, phenomenal stuff there. And it's trying. And Daewoo might be the first man in your house, and he is. So, whoa.
Bell, Bellsy, I know you're up here in the commentary box, but uh, I didn't know you were uh, engineering the house team right now for uh, soft tires. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Definitely is a gamble, I think. Yeah, already. Get, yeah, this is what happens when it gets tricky. They lose and perhaps a safety car, but no, it hasn't happened. Sorry to cut you off on that one, mate. Now I'm getting excited. Of course, it's the last round. About got smoked by Victor Diaz. As Victor came around that last corner with an Alfa Romeo just right in front of him, going slow off the race line, of course. In that front but, wing. <laughs> yeah, that. Victor Diaz getting by Klinsman as Klinsman, I believe, made a mistake coming out of the last corner, and Victor Diaz had a lot of just over speed on the McLaren sector. So clearly, yes, it's not the crossover point yet I... for the softs. Just stopping just for, for yeah, another for... set of inters for him. Fresh intermediate tires on the Red Bull. We could all switch around. We could have a, is that Kamel? 2008 moment coming around the corner. I don't know. <laughs> so don't go anywhere. Yep. We are it's getting intermediates so as well. Yeah. So no gambles in the Red Bull garage that have obviously done a fantastic job with the tire strategy this season. We've proven that. No real F1. The metal we? also into Guys, the pits. Thumbs up, thumbs down. What do you think is the best strategy right now? What is the call in the late dying stages of this race where it's basically, who knows if it's dry or it's wet? But we'll find out, won't we? Victor Diaz is into the pits on the soft compound tires as well. Big difference here. No, it's not. Ooh. It's not. Not going to bring one in, but Jetty bringing it across the fast lap of the session. 145.2 is... <laughs> well, those Red Bulls were within a second of each other for most it's of this race. mastermind of strategies all season long. So if you were to make a decision on tires, on strategy, you need to talk to Jet. And he said, everyone's stopping for subs right now. Oh, this is retired from the session on the soft compound tires. Losing it. That's it's that's a safety, safety car. car. What does Jet do? What does Jet do? What is, uh, Jet do? <laughs> the pit lane last minute. He's got it done. Oh, Jet, everything's falling in your hands right now for the Red Bull. Races all season, believe it or not. Just like the regular F1 world, we're going to come down to the crunch here for a final couple of oh, laps man. for the final round of the season four division two season. This is going to be interesting. Awesome. I like the pit drive through for Kimi Heineken, unfortunately, as the Williams driver gets a speeding under the safety car that is going to hurt him. Just in the final points paying position, but with no penalties. Oh, it's man. It's going to be close. <laughs> what? In last, mind you, is all the way up to P4 now. Kimmy's melting. Yeah, oh. Kimmy's serving the... Wait, he, he cannot oh, serve the drive yeah, through under the safety guard. Play. So. That means Alpine gets an extra point here. Yeah, that's an extra point for them. So, uh... so therefore, Jet can cross the line in change of conditions with his teammate behind him and say, well, we'll find out what he will say. Only hindsight is 2020 safety car is in this lap. Yes, let's get things back underway. We're going to be starting off with lap 27, followed by our car it is in. Jet leading the charge. AJ in P2, Leaky P3, Axel P4, Kamel P5 for the current time. Yes, he is. Victor Diaz up into the PA position, trying to bring that Alpine squad, trying to secure it. It's all going to end up. Fuck up. He wins the series and he wins the championship. Jet, you are my man of this series. Right at the end, we can call uh, our friend, um, the, the Haas guy. Um, what was his name again? <laughs> Dangwu. Dangwu at